Uncle Momo's music reaction channel where I provide my views on talented artists who have no subscribers and no views as well as talented artists from around the world. Now, once again, I have no idea or the reason why they have no subscribers or no views, but I'm going to bring it to the forefront of my channel for us to view. Now, today I'm going to do my best to upload about, say, three reactions, and I will let you know on these particular artists as I'm going along. So, my first reaction of today, which I'm so excited about, is going, it's coming up from um, Ukraine, Onika. Now, if you don't know about Onika, slap yourself right now, because she is an absolutely amazing artist. I've had the pleasure of reacting to Onika. And uh, when I first started my reaction and she was the first person to send me a message regarding my reactions. And since then, I've been sending her messages via Instagram and she sends me messages as well as a number of other Ukraine, brilliant Ukraine artists. And they reply back. I've got about a good, I've got about, say, 85 percent success rate of uh, artists from Ukraine that send me messages when I send them messages. And at those 85%, I've had 40% um, of the, uh, them artists has recommended me other artists for me to check out. If you don't believe me, go into my community page. Go all the way down to the bottom and you see the recommendations. Like Antitilla, he sent me a recommendation of checking out another band. Ginger, they sent me that recommendation. You know, um, Alona Lona is absolutely amazing. She sent me loads of recommendations. Um, and so it's just really nice to, it was the first country to, pr to put me under, bring me underneath their wings was Ukraine, without a doubt. I, I'll let you know right now, without a doubt, they're the first person to put me underneath their wings and they still are comfort me and guide me. So I'd like to say a good morning to my Ukraine sub um, subscribers, how are you? I hope you are well. Um, thank you for still being here. Thank you for still supporting me. Um, you guys have been absolutely brilliant. You really are the backbone of my of my of my channel. <laughs> I, 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 without hands down, without a doubt, um, and it will continue to grow. I know, and I hope you appreciate the other music that I'm bringing in from around the world, and you guys speaking to each other and interacting with each other because that is an absolutely brilliant thing. I can be blabbering on for ages about this. Um, look, if you'd like to follow me um, on any social media platform, go over to my about page. There's a number of links there. Just click on it and it'll take you straight over to there. Um, if you want to follow me here, um, then please subscribe as well as hit the notification button to indicate to you when my next uploads will be. That would be, ter be terrific. It really would. Anyway, look, let's go straight into my first reaction of today. So this is Onika with um, Guma or is it, is it Guma? Let me know um, how to pronounce that correctly anyway without further ado you know what we're here for great vocabs and a damn good video all joe music can you dig it only onika can start off with a tannoy and it'd be so interesting <laughs> what are they drones Near Vachel. Near Vachel. I think they're all clones or androids. Cleverly done. It's got this lovely little swing to it, hasn't it? He did it. <laughs> it's like a trance. Near Vacho. Near Dude. 
you know what this reminds me of? There's a band in the 80s, an English band in the 80s. Um, they were well known, so you might have known them. I'm trying to remember their name. Um, they sung um, around the world, around the world, around the world, around the world. No, no, that wasn't. No, that was. It was that. That could be them, or was that Kylie Minogue? They sung um, um, Weekend Boys. In and out, down, down, and the Weekend Boys. The Weekend World, the Weekend Boys. Weekend, dun, 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 dun. Oh, what are they called? Um, something Boys, I think they were called. But their, their, their visuals is similar to what Onika's, this, this particular um, video is like. Um, don't get me wrong, all Onika's videos are absolutely mind-blowing. You know, hats off to her husband. He he knows how to create um, a music video. But I was talking about this particular one. As futuristic as it, um, it, it, it looks like and feels to be with the clones and the AIs and the technology and all that kind of stuff and the, and the clothes. Um, it almost kind of like... Um, the, the, the design is almost like, you know, in back in the 80s and 90s, they kind of predicted how the future would be. And they started making these um, future clothing, future glasses, these future, uh, the cars, how the cars of tomorrow. And it was kind of like that kind of design. It kind of like retro versus futuristic. And, and that's what I'm seeing within this music video. Mind blowing. Really brilliant. Because you've got to think out of the box so much to create something like this. And it's so hard to think out of the box nowadays when you've got so many artists following the same pattern, you know? So it's just, it's a fresh, it's a warm, fresh of breath air when I, when I react to, uh, or see Annika do anything because she's so out of the box. She's so, she never follows the same kind of lane that everybody else is, um, is going on. She creates her own lane, you know? And if there isn't a and if there ain't a road to create a lane, then she'll swim it. Do you know? It's it's she always will find that alternative to the norm, and that's what I love about Onika. It's the alternative to the norm. I'm gonna go back just a little bit. I did it. This song reminds me also of an R&B song from the States. Um, wow. Just the beat itself, the R and B. I love that. What it's called not a flute, or we call it something else. Elena Pesh does it a lot in her video as well. That flute sound. So there's an R&B track in the States that's got a similar beat to it. So that was Onika um, with Guma. And I hope I'm pronouncing the name right, Guma. Or it could be something else, or Guma. Or, or, I don't know. But let me know if I've got it totally wrong. Like I said, there's a band... Over the UK, um, that's predominantly ruled the the uh, in the nineties. Something boys, not Lost Boys or something. I, I can't remember. Um, but she and they are properly established, just like Onika is established. But the similarities um, between this music video and their music video is very uncanny. It really is. And, and uh, I, I did explain a, a couple of their songs what they did. Um, what they did. So I hope you get the gist of it. Um, but Annika is in her own world, totally in her own world, from fas fashion sense, um, 
her presence, whether it be on the music video or on stage or when she does a live performances on stage, she just brings a different kind of angle to, to the scene. She always does. And I love that. It's like, you know, when you can be listening to an album for, uh, you know, you've got a, like, say, three hour drive and you listen to the radio and it's like, oh, give me something. Because you're playing the same songs by different artists, but it's just it's almost like the same song playing over and over again. And but when you get an Onika song, it's you know it's fresh out of the box. It's a different kind of dimension. It gives you a different kind of feeling altogether, and it just sets your day. It really does. It sets my day anyway. It keeps you thinking, and it keeps you wondering. And there's certain things like you have to go back into an Onika um, music video at least ten times just to get the whole gist of the visuals and what's playing the, and what the parts of the visuals play in there, the intricate um, um, pieces that they put in the music video. It has a significant reason why it's there. And in all of her music videos, like I said, I've, all of her music videos, I have to, I mean, I've, over 20 times I've watched her music videos, different part, different ones, because it just brings different kind of arrays um, and to it. it, really does. She's an amazing artist, she really is. And for that reason, I salute you. I'm going to go back now and put the subtitles on. <laughs> Yay! 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 Yay!